In this video, we'll answer the question whether KCl is an electrolyte or a non-electrolyte. This is potassium chloride. The first thing to note about potassium chloride is we have a metal and a non-metal. So when we have a metal and a non-metal, we're going to have an ionic compound. And if an ionic compound dissolves in water and splits apart into its ions, then we'll have an electrolyte. So potassium, if you know your solubility rules, Potassium is very soluble, so we expect this will dissolve completely in water, break apart into its ions, and be an electrolyte. In that solution, it'll conduct electricity. So potassium ions, potassium is in group one on the periodic table. Potassium forms one plus ions, the potassium ion. For Cl, that's in group 17, also called 7A, that will form one minus ionic compounds. This is the chloride ion. And because we've dissolved them in water, we're going to write AQ for aqueous after these to show they're dissolved in water. So in answer to our question, KCl, potassium chloride, it's an electrolyte. And in fact, it's a strong electrolyte because it's very soluble, dissolves in water, breaks apart into its ions. This is Dr. B answering the question whether KCl, potassium chloride, is an electrolyte or a non-electrolyte. It's a strong electrolyte. Thanks for watching.